Yo guys, welcome back to the channel. Today I'm going to be breaking down three different telephone style bases inside of Vital, Serum, and Subtractor. I'm also going to leave a link down in the description to my Discord where you can grab all the presets from today's video for free. But yeah, let's go ahead and hop into it. Alright, so let's go ahead and open up Reason first. This one I feel like has a nice little like bad face kind of vibe to it. I'll go ahead and play it. Yeah, cool. So let's go ahead and get another one of these and I'll show you how I made it. First of all, I started off by putting it on a square. Brought the octave down to two and I turned on oscillator two and turned the phase all the way up. For these modes, I just put this one in the middle and this one on the top. For our LFO one, we just want to turn it on sync. I used this one, but later on we can mess with different versions of this to get different sounds out of it, which can be really cool. And I just turned the rate up to one eighth triplet, brought the amount up a little bit as well. And now you can just subtly hear the LFO, but if we change it to FM, now we're starting to kind of get that bloopy telephone alarm bass kind of sound. We're going to mess with the modulation envelope right here. I'm going to put this to FM as well. Turn the amount up a little bit, bring the sustain up quite a ways, and then bring the attack and the decay up a little bit. And now we're starting to get that alarm bass kind of sound to it. Let's go ahead and pull the resonance up on filter 1 and change this to a notch. And now we're pretty much there. I want to change LFO 2 to an amp though. Bring the rate all the way up with the amount around 12 o'clock. Okay, cool. And now you can kind of hear this humming sound in the background. So I'm going to bring the mix down here. Yeah, there we go. They got rid of it. And then the FM amount, I'm going to bring up a little bit as well. Now the alarm is alarming. For this section here, like I spoke about earlier, you can make a bunch of different variations in the, in the style of the sound with these. So now we got like more of like a telephone. And then you got these ones, which are like computer data kind of sounding, but they don't really have like as much of a consistent LFO. Those can be kind of cool for making fills, kind of some R2-D2. This one's a little bit more soft. Kind of like a goofy filter. Oh man, I just got the fresh cut. You already know we live how much. <laughs> But yeah, playing around with these, I personally like this one a lot. And then for the beginning, how it's like kind of ramping into the sustain, that's all with the modulation envelope. So with the attack, if I bring the attack down and the decay down, it kind of just starts at the sustain. So like by bringing this up, it kind of gives it that artifact in the, in the beginning of the synth. And the higher up these goes, the more. Kind of gives you that Stains vibe. Shout out Stains, by the way. Go listen to his music. But yeah, all these presets are available in my Discord 100% free. So go ahead and download the preset, open it up. It'll be set up like this, and you can just kind of start playing with parameters and making it your own. All right, moving on to Vital. What I did is I put the LFO over here on 1 8th and changed the mode to tempo triplets. And then I just drew in this little square shape here. I put in basic shapes, and then I just changed it from a sign to a square. Then I turned the the pitch up two octaves or 24 then i took lfo1 i put it on the pitch and turned it up a little bit and that gives you this little like alarm clock kind of sound i put fm from oscillator 2 i just changed this from a sign to a square then i put an inharmonic stretch on here and just kind of turned up the spectral morph of it a bit then i made a second lfo at four over one so that it just kind of builds into a sustain similar to the reason one and i put this lfo on the pitch of oscillator 2 because i fm'd this from oscillator 2 i just turned the level all the way down and finally i made a third lfo also at four over one with the a little bit less of a steep ramp into a sustain that I put on the FN altogether that gives you this. <laughs> Hopping over to effects, we have a distortion. I did an EQ to get rid of some of the lows, and then a chorus. <laughs> But yeah, let's go ahead and move on to Serum. So again, we started off with basic shapes. We moved the wavetable position from a sign to a square. LFO1, we drew in a square shape again, put it on 1 8th triplet. I put this LFO on the course pitch up here. And so next I did an LFO2 where I just kind of drew in this little ramp so that it like kind of pitches up and then slowly descends. 
And I threw that on the course pitch as well. So if I bypass this, this is what this sounds like with that. I added FM from B and then I just added basic shapes again. But instead of going with a square, I went with this little slope. Turn the course pitch way up like to 40. I turned the level all the way down. I made this LFO shape here kind of a ramp into a sustain. And I put this on the FM from B so that it's bringing the signal from this in slowly. And that gives us this. For effects, I added distortion, kind of just to make it louder, and then an EQ rolling off the lows as well, a compressor, glue everything together, make it louder, and then finally a hyper dimension with the size brought down a little bit, and then the mix set to around like 10 o'clock, and that is this. Just kind of gives it some stereo. And yeah, that's pretty much it. So if you want to grab any of the three presets that we made today, they're available in my Discord. The link will be down in the description. I'll be adding more presets from future videos as well. So make sure you're joined in the Discord so you don't miss out on those. But yeah, thanks again for watching and we will catch you in the next one, guys. Peace.